My name is Jamira Burley, and I'm a native of Philadelphia. I'm also a rising senior at Temple University, where I major in international business legal studies with a minor in Chinese. Yeah, <laughs> I said Chinese. And as the first in my family to not only graduate high school, but to go on to college, I know all too well the harsh realities of today. And I have watched as those harsh realities take hold of my family. In 2005, my brother Andre was murdered at the hands of his friend. And since then, I have been filled with a sense of purpose to not only ensure that my community doesn't have to lose another young person to the barrel of a bullet, but also to make sure that none of the family doesn't have to go through the same hurt and loss that mine went through. Since my brother's murder, I have been working tirelessly to ensure that youth are brought to the table of discussion when decisions about our future are being made. And then, and only then, can we as a society start to move forward in trying to deal with some of the youth-related problems facing our world, such as violence and lack of education. I have been doing this through my numerous leadership positions over the years. Most recently, I am the mayor's appointee and chairwoman of the Philadelphia Youth Commission. I'm also the governor's appointee to the Commission on Children and Family, as well as the vice president of the SEPTA Youth Advisory Council. Through these leadership positions, I've met with state and local officials to discuss with them some of the important issues facing our society. I've also met with institutional providers to express to them the importance of bringing youth to the table of discussion to talk about issues that are important to them. Too often, youth are considered to be the future, but in all reality, we're the here and the now. And how can we positively impact our community tomorrow if we do not first become actively engaged today? So my progressive change is to bring youth to the table of discussion when decisions about our future are being made. There should be no decision about us without us. Thank you.